Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the playground. We are starting off with the spot. A interesting mod. It kind of reminds me of the, the cheese touch from Diary of a Wimpy Kid. You have the touch, you touch somebody and they get the touch. But I'm actually not really sure if this is based off of something. The description reads as if I'm supposed to already know what this is, but I don't. So we're gonna discover it together. Looks like there's some powers to be had. I guess I will start with the blank spot. It's a spot with blank. I don't know what that means. There's no spots here. I think that's what it means. Seems like a pretty normal looking guy. Whoa. What did I do? What did I do? Stop. I just sent him to the spot dimension. I'm so, I'm so sorry. Uh, I don't like that. I don't like this. I don't like the spot dimension. We don't go there. Portal. Would you like to go in the portal? I didn't know that this uh, had portals. Portal here. That doesn't seem like a portal to me. Can we activate the portal? Oh, okay. He's gonna be fine. How do I send myself through the portal without making a rupture in space and time? Oh! Uh, what just happened? What did what? Okay, so the portal, it just doesn't go anywhere. But if it's versus someone that isn't invincible, they will get eaten. I like this one. I don't know where it's sending these body parts. I don't really care either. Just feed it. Give it a sacrifice so it leaves us alone. Huh, the beast has given something back. Looks like it's satisfied with the sacrifices. Just a couple more. Just, just, just to be extra sure. Oh yeah, no one's ever getting out of this. Nice, it works with these spiders as well. What about a vehicle? Does it do anything? Oh, it does. No way. The entire car. <laughs> the portals don't want to eat the doors. They're gross. All right, this guy here, he's covered in spots. And I have a feeling that the spots have something to do with the portal, because they look kind of like small portals. Where did he go? Oh, he's over there. Why was that so loud? Whoa, whoa. Turn it down, buddy. <laughs> what? A he got mangled. Somewhere in space and time, his limbs were turned into hash. What happens if two portal men touch nothing? Oh, wait, wait, wait. It actually worked. <laughs> now we have the spot man third form. He looks a little different. Not not really that much different if I oh, Touch ah uh, ah uh, I thought I could touch him. It was working for a second <laughs> He's been mangled There's also a bagel included in this mod. I really have no idea why but it sounds like it's made of concrete the, the hardest bagel. This is the bagel that they have at the end of the day at Panera Bread. Can the bagel defeat a man with the cheese touch? Yes. Bagel is actually the only way to interact with these guys. That's it. Look at that. Bagel wins every single freaking time. This is the Alk Max rifle. Looks like it disposes of them pretty well. Gets rid of the cheese touch very effectively. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, no teleporting the gun. You will pay for your crimes, Jonathan. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the infinite map, which is a little misleading because it's not actually infinite. The map is 5 million times 10 million of whatever unit of measurement the game uses. <laughs> I'm not sure, but it is bigger than humongous. This is how big humongous is. I don't even know how they're even doing this. This is, uh, this seems like they're cheating. Okay, here we are on the infinite map. A small man here. Wait a minute, I picked the wrong map. This is the, this is the map right here. You can tell because floating pipe. I don't know where that came from. Characters no longer on the screen. I'm still zooming out. Still zooming out. I'm still, wait, why is it so big? That's huge. It's, um, I don't even know. G -gig enormous. I can't even express to you how small that is. This guy, he's gonna be falling forever. He's, he's gonna, look at that. If there was ever a place you wanted to test out your flying machines, this could possibly be it. You know, this could be the place. Hopefully your flying machine's better than mine. Mine sucks, dude. Ah, yes. This shall be much better. Activate. No. Well, it looks like it's a good thing that we have a lot of space to be able to test out. No, no, wait. No. Well, as you can see, this is the perfect place to test out to see if your flying machine works. The team over at Int Studios have updated the Minecraft Swords mod by adding biting Minecraft zombies. Being able to infect the NPCs. Oh my goodness. How could this have happened? Here we have a harmless Steve and a harmless Alex. But we release patient zero into the mix to bite the Steve. Do it. Oh, it worked! The zombies throw themselves at the innocent bystanders. 
It works though. That's the beautiful thing about it is that it just just works. You gotta you gotta hit him pretty hard though. <laughs> the chain reaction, zombification. With enough force, you can infect the entire town. Nothing will stop their reign of terror. Besides this sick looking car. Can the zombies be defended against? Oh yes. Oh yes, they, they, they can certainly be damaged. As you can tell, it's not looking good for the zombie. But can they be infected after the fact? After that they've died double time. They can't infect anymore if they did. <laughs> what happens if I get infected? Is that a possibility or does it just work with these NPCs? Infect me! It doesn't work. You need the special NPCs. All right, I was I was dreaming a little bit too hard with that one. I didn't even realize this before, but you can lean in with the zombie and hit F. Snake in People Playground is a very simple mod that gives us a monitor and allows us to connect controls so that we can play Snake in a 2D game physics engine. I don't know why. He's currently making a Google browser. I don't think four inputs is enough here to be able to type anything into Google. 100,000 likes, he's promising doom. I don't believe that. 500,000 favorites, he just remakes the entire game with four inputs. Also, I think this is fake. <laughs> but if he could do it, that would be cool. Oh my goodness, here it is. The monitor. The thing that we're all waiting for. They actually make you set this thing up, dude. I gotta add some buttons so that I can actually play this game. So I'm gonna set the buttons up so that it looks like a W, S, A, and D. The order of the inputs is left, up, right, down. Okay. But I would like to go right. What? That, that wasn't the right way. Okay, that is up? What? No. Down. Down? Why is that up? That's not right! I think I finally got it, yes. Down. Oh wait, no, I died! Up. Here we go, here we go, here we go, left! Yes. Down! How? Why is down turning off? Alright, we're playing hardcore mode. Alright, we gotta go down. Uh, we gotta go, we gotta go down. Again, left. Down. Left. Up. Up. Right. Get it! Come on. You can get it. Yes. Yes! Okay, up. I think that was a pretty successful run. I don't know about you guys, that was pretty good. Um, the player has is deceased, but it's fine because it worked. It was, and it was fun. And that's all that matters, that we had fun. All the mods are linked in the description along with their creators. Thank you all so much. I will see you all in the next video.